welcome back to Beauty for You with Danielle, and I hope you guys are having a blessed Sunday. Um, today's um, going to be a video on some of my favorite things that I am loving at the moment for my hair and for my skin. And um, I'm going to go ahead and get started. Don't pay attention to my hair, guys. I feel like this is a twist out fail. Yeah. My first time doing a twist out, I don't know, maybe I didn't do something right, I'm not really sure, I haven't really mastered it just yet, but, um, or I just feel like my hair just needs to grow out more, because, you know, I still have that shrinkage on the side, this is about, you know, and it just shrivels up, so this is how long it is on the side, and I still got that shrinkage going on in the back, hair seems to be growing very slow back here but growing real rapid in the top and my curls are looser but anyway uh, just twist out I just untwisted my hair um, this morning after a wash and go but I don't know we'll see anyway let me tell you guys about some of the products that I've been using in my hair that I really really truly love um, and let me just tell you this um, the products that I use in my hair for my hair type may not be, you know, may not work for you. But if you are wanting to go out and try it, by all means, go ahead and try it. So now we'll go ahead and get started. Okay, how I achieved this look today with this twist out is I use Miss Jessie's Curly Pudding. This is the um, third time that I've actually tried this product since I've um, purchased it. And I must say that I really, truly love this product. I love the the way that it really um, enhances my curls, everything, you guys. Everything about this product is just phenomenal. Um, it makes my hair super, super, super soft. It really, really, truly enhances my curl powder and everything because my hair is very fine but very naturally curly. Um, and, you know, when I twisted it, you know, just... You know, I don't know. I just really, really like the way it makes my hair feel. I don't, my hair doesn't feel crunchy or any of that. So, um, and it has a, a slogan on here that says the best darn curl cream period. And yes, I do agree with it. It is the best. But um, I also can achieve the same um, look by using the um, Icy Styling Gel. I can achieve the same look also. Um, this also makes my hair super, super soft, does not make it crunchy or any of that, and I like to use this also with my wash and goes. I still love my Eco Styler Gel. My favorite Eco Styler Gel is the, uh, the Clear Ice um, and the um, Moroccan Argan Oil. Those are my two favorites um, when it comes to the Eco Styler Gel. Um, shampoos, guys, um, the shampoos that I have been using was the Suave um, Rosemary Mint. I actually picked this up at Walmart for $2.84. This is a 32-ounce um, jar of um, the Rosemary Mint. This makes my hair very good, and this is for all hair types. So I like the way this makes it feel. You get the tingling sensation and everything, and it really gets your hair really squeaky clean without um, stripping any of your color or any of that. And of course, you all, you guys already know that I love my Tresemme product. Anything by Tresemme, I absolutely stand by it 100%. I have been using their uh, Flawless Curl Line. This is for natural curly hair and wavy hair, guys. I must say, I picked this up at Walmart also yesterday for $3.84, and this is a 32-ounce jar of the shampoo, and here is the conditioner. I absolutely love Tresemme. Tresemme is good for your natural hair and also for the weaves, guys, if you wear your weaves, and it's also good for the wigs. If you want to shampoo your hair and go, Tresemme is in my... This is my number one shampoo right here. really is my number one shampoo. Also, guys, I've been using the um, Soft Sheen Carson. This is their uh, Weave Wig Spray. Well, actually, it says Weave Care, but it's like a detangler, and this is really good for your natural hair as well. 
So um, you guys should go and pick this up. This was at my local beauty supply store. I picked this up for $9. And at first I was a little skeptical. I was like, $9? I was like, I don't want to pay no $9 for no um, no wig spray. Because you guys, I am on a budget and I am cheap, okay? So I was like, hmm. I was like, I'm going to try it. So I went on and tried it because one of my um, hairstylists recommended me to get this. A friend of mine who's a hairstylist. So I was like, I'm going to try it. Okay, guys, sorry about that. My camera cut off on me while I was talking. But anyway, um, I'm going to, you know, one of these days, we're going to get me a larger memory card. Cause that's what the problem is. I need a larger memory card. Um, so anyway, I was, I believe I was talking about the Soft Sheen Carson um, Weave Care Spray. So, yeah, if you guys have never tried this, I do rec highly recommend it because it's, this is a very good product. Um, even though it's nine dollars, it absolutely does work for your natural hair as well as um, your weaves and your wigs. Um, okay, now we're going to get into talking about some cosmetics. Let's see. Um, we'll talk about Avon. I've been using the uh, a new line for your skin. This one here is the. Um, a new rejuvenate um, gel cleanser and uh, this one here is the eye moisturizer and this one is the revitalizing um, this is just for your face it's like a skin cream and this other one is the same thing but it's like this one is for daytime, and the blue one is for nighttime. So I've, I have been using this for a total of about two months, and I have totally, tremendously seen a difference in my skin, so I really do like this. I like to use it as a moisturizer, so yeah. And, okay. Looks like it was getting dark. Sorry, guys. I don't know if I'm going to have to turn this light back on or not. Anyhow, um... I've been using that on my skin, and I absolutely love the way that it makes my skin feel um, after, you know, using it. And I've really seen, like, a tremendous difference. My skin, I've never had dry skin, but there are times, because I do suffer from eczema, and I have sometimes will get dry spots on my face. Um, and I do have um, adult acne from time to time. I get really bad breakouts, and... So I was trying to find something different to use besides using always using a um, an acne product. So I started to use this, and I actually really do like this line. However, I also for my skin for my blemishes, um, I have always used Ambi products. This cream right here is for normal skin. Um, it's a fade cream, and I absolutely do love it. Um, even though I have a little concealer on right now that you can't really see. But when I decide to not wear makeup at all, I just put this on in the morning and at night. And then usually on the weekends, um, I don't wear any makeup. I, this really actually, actually fades my um, blemishes. So any blemishes that you have, definitely use their um, fade cream. And I also use their black soap, which I don't have in front of me. But I also use that as a skin cleanser along actually with the Anew by Avon. I use the Ambi Black Soap. It absolutely works wonders. So I have really been loving the way that it has making my skin feel. And I've had less breakouts. Um, the, the most times that I have breakouts is when it's that time of the month. Or if I eat a lot of sweets or something, then I'll get like a breakout. But other than that, no breakouts, guys. Um, last but not least, the other things that I wanted to talk to you guys about was the Black Opal products. I've been using Black Opal products for quite some time, and I absolutely really do love their products. I love their um, Total Coverage Concealing Foundation. This one here is in Heavenly Honey. It looks like this. It's very thick. You can actually use this as a concealer also, but I love the consistency, and I love how it stays on my skin, and it makes my skin look flawless. Um, when I don't want to use this, when it's a really hot day outside, um, instead of putting something really heavy on my face, they also have a concealer stick that looks like this, comes in the tube, 
And this one here is in the color Toast. This is absolutely my favorite. This is the one that I have really been using throughout the summer with the really hot and humid days that we've been having here in Maryland. Um, I just put it on the spots where I want to conceal, and I just put a little bit of uh, press powder on, and I'm out the door, and I'm just gone. And I may have to touch up with a little bit every now and then throughout the day, maybe, but I absolutely love this. I wish that this actually came in a bigger stick, like their um, foundation sticks, but they don't have this color, and this color is a ma perfect match to my skin tone. Um, the Heavenly Honey is also, because sometimes I will mix the two together to get the perfect um, color in the uh, summertime, but in the wintertime, I definitely just use this all the way. So this is really my favorite. And all these products was picked up at CVS, I believe. I, I think I got them for CVS, and I think um, this was like $6 and something, and um, I know that I get this. I usually get this from Walmart. This is where I normally get this for the cheapest, and this is usually about $8.95 or $9.95, something like that. And then their newest product that I've been trying is their Fade Concealer, and it looks like a... Um, comes with a wand like this with the product on it. This is okay too. Um, however, this color does not work for me. This color is actually too dark, as you can see, way too dark. So I usually have to use this with um, a little of the uh, Coverage Concealer Foundation. This color is in um, Beautiful Bronze. So I like this also for a quick and go co coverage, you know and go. So that's it guys. Um, I don't have anything else to talk about as far as my favorites, what I'm liking right now at the moment, but I will say that I would like to thank all of my new subscribers. I have not been able to get to you one by one to um, welcome you to my channel. So welcome, welcome, welcome to you all. And I'd like to also welcome all of my old subbies who have been holding me down since day one. I love you guys and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.